<laughs> now if you rise up your arms, ready to dive into the ocean, go Elliot, dive! Dive in! <laughs> So one thing that Elliot's been suffering with recently is sleeping disorder. He's been waking up in the nights, running around the room, shouting, there's a sheep in my room, sheep in my room, there's a snake in the bed, all random stuff. Last night he saw Trump, and the other day he saw Hillary. I don't know, don't care. The point is, actually, before we even start this video, within the next 10 seconds, smash that like button if you want to shout out now. Seven, six, five. Subscribe as well if you want to shout out. Four, three, two, one, boom, you will have a shout out at the end of this video. So Elliot's sleep, so, so as I was saying, Elliot's suffering with disorder, sleeping disorder. I've got a friend called Shani. Shani is a hypnotherapist. He says that he can help Elliot with a sleeping disorder, when in fact, Elliot just needs a little bit more sleep and a little less alcohol. We're gonna get Shani in today, hypnotize Elliot. Obviously, we're not gonna fix the sleeping disorder. We're just gonna screw around him and make him a weirdo. Sorry, bro. I know you're professional at this and you do this a lot. It's just where your thoughts are. Well, what, uh, what is the, seems to be the problem? Is he waking up in the night and... He's currently having nightmares where he wakes up from crazy dreams yes. shouting, yes. Snake! Sheep! Snake! Dragon! Sheep! Yeah, exactly. Dragons. Exactly. The point is, though, yes. I know you do a good job, but before you, like, help him, I kind of want to piss about yeah, him My sugar levels are rather low. I mean, it's, I'm just going to tuck into this if it's all right with Yeah, you. sure can. Uh, you no problem. You're at the car. Uh, we want to mess around him a little bit first and have a bit of fun to make him, I don't know, do well, some stupid I'm stuff. I'm sure we can get around that quite well. And yeah. we'll, we'll mess his brain up a little bit if that's, if that's what you're looking for. It's not always reversible. <laughs> I'll have you know it. It sometimes <laughs> sends you into the nut, nut house <laughs> type thing at, like, like myself, but <laughs> I'm okay now. Ish. Elliot's going to be any minute. Carl, do you want to come help me open the door? I would door? love to. Yeah, absolutely love to. Well. He is the man for honesty. He's perfect for this. Jesus Christ, where the hell did you find him? Country. That's him. He's on his way. Oh, flip me. Carl. I don't think this is a good idea. This could psychologically mess him up. So? More than he's already psychologically messed up. So? Excuse the mess, guys. We're having a bit of a refurbishment. Team bro! Oh. <laughs> ah. What are you two doing? Well, we've arranged this for you, Eddie, to help you. Nothing else. You said you need help. We're helping. Why are you recording? Because, because he is Elliot. This the guy's asking to document it for him. So, yeah, listen. Document it for him. What is this? Listen, this guy is the top hypnotherapist in the UK. He costs What's he going to do for me? Money. He will help you, bro, with your sleeping disorder. Elliot's got a. As, they, I I've, sleep told, walk. I've told them. I've told them. Uh, yes, I sleep, talk, and walk. Not my fault, all right? I was born with that. He's found in a bush. That says it all. You need to be polite in here. He's a bit, you know, a bit self. Just be polite. Why right, Indy's he's helping me, bro. Yeah? You want to get you want to get yeah, someone help? Okay, cool, yeah, cool. Elliot, how yeah. are you, darling? I've heard a lot about you. Elliot's the uh, victim or whatever client. Do you want to say? Do you want the, you want the lights off, someone? Uh, yes, put yeah. them off, Ben. It'd be brilliant. I want off. As yeah. relaxed as possible. Okay, so do you feel relaxed and at peace with yourself and the world and everything else around this magical? Do you feel that? Not yet. Okay, well, put your head back into the seat. Relax. And you'll watch my hand and what releases in front of you. Now watch the pendulum tick back and forth. Don't worry about Ben. Don't worry about Carl. Don't worry about me, the most extremely handsome man in the world. Just watch the pendulum. At the count of three, you will be under a complete trance. One, you feel sleepy. Two, you feel your eyes closing. And three, you're under. Now, relax. Now be at peace. You're on the beach. You're totally relaxed. Your subconscious mind is taking over now. That's crazy. And the conscious reality is no longer there. Feel free to move around the room. You may stand up physically. Take your feet and stand up, child. Now you will follow me, my child. Turn. Okay. And you will stand upon the chair that's in front of you. If you raise your left foot, you will stand up with confidence. Don't be scared of it. Don't be scared of it. I'm going to spin you now. And you're spinning faster because you're a confident young male and it's excellent. You're at wind. The winds are going wild. And stop. That's brilliant. And step down off the chair. Right foot first, my friend. And now we're going towards the sea for a swim with the dolphins and the fishes. So if you'll walk forward 
One, two, stop. You're back at the seaside. You're by the ocean. Full of exotic creatures like yourself. Full of exotic fish and coral that you'll pick out with your teeth. And you'll flirt with the dolphins while they welcome you into their homes. Now if you rise up your arms, ready to dive into the ocean, go Elliot, dive! Dive in! <laughs> it seems the waters were a little shallow, but that's okay, because if you swim, you make it to the deep end. You must swim with more power, more aggression. Come on, Elliot. You're no Michael Phelps, but you are the Giles. He's found it. Now, dive down, my friend. Into the depths below. And you rise to your feet once more. We're back on land. We're in the office. You're back in the office. There's another chair, my friend, which I want you to sit in. And I want you to make it yours. This is all your chair. How would you like to mix things up a little bit? Mix up, bro. Throw out the bloody window if you want to. Let's start with baby steps, Ben, and we'll make our way to the big boys. All this commotion has made you quite revived, but still tired. I'd like you to stand up. And the next two words are going to be very important because they're going to allow you to act upon it. <clears throat> so when I say the words snake bite, you will progressively punch yourself into your penis. We'll see if it works. Like I said, you're on a beach and then snake bite. <laughs> but it doesn't hurt. <laughs> Like I said, oh, you just you just say snake bite. Like I said, <laughs> oh my God. I want to go snake bite. Oh, I'll stop. You'll probably stop saying snake bite so much. <laughs> Why do you call it snake bite? <laughs> now we've got that snake bite business out of the way. You may turn and follow the sound of my voice. You want a shot of tequila, so I'm going to give you. A shot of tequila. So hold out your hand. Take the shot. Shot. Good. But then, what do you need with tequila? The salt is one of the most crucial things when taking a shot of tequila. So hold out your hand, and I'm going to give you a rather thick, girthy <laughs> carton of salt. Now, hold your head back, and stick out your tongue, and shake the salt all over your tongue and all over your face. <laughs> Faster snake bite! <laughs> That's quite enough for any man. <laughs> but but no more of so you doing all the work. How about some work done for you, my friend? I have a beautiful young lady who has quite an amount of suction from within her. What? By the name huh? of Dyson. <laughs> now, if you wait there, no, you did it before the Henry. Undo your trousers. No. And you're going to drop them. Confidently. And you're going to take off your hoodie. Confidently. He doesn't need any help, you see. He knows everything. Excellent. Now you wait there and get prepared for your new lady friend Dyson. What are you doing? You said you wanted to mix things up a bit, Ben, so I am. Why do you mean, like, your personal fetishes? Like, well, you know, I'm quite an eccentric character and I have my needs. So let you me what? get back to my work. Did you just say he had his needs? <laughs> this is not, bro, this is weird. Meet, hold out your hand, and meet Dyson. <laughs> now, I'd like you to do whatever it is that first pops into your head with Dyson. But don't do that it's until weird. you hear a loud it's electric weird. noise. <laughs> this thing doesn't seem to be working. <laughs> Push the red button. Yeah. The first thing that comes to your head, Elliot. Oh, what the hell? <laughs> the, the, the second thing that comes to your head, child. The second thing. <laughs> now, this is disgusting noise. <laughs> at the count of three, you will wake up. One. Your eyes are feeling less heavy now. Two, you're slowly coming out of the trance and it has one with consciousness. And three, you're awake. <laughs> what the f? <laughs> 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 <laughs>
That's a perverted, what the f***? Come here, come here. Guys, you thought I forgot that shout out? No, shout outs today by Swooga Fluga, who misses the old super glue sunbed type pranks. I wish I could make that prank every day, but let's face it, it would get predictable. But don't worry, super glue's coming back with a vengeance. This was actually an alright prank compared to a lot of the recent ones. Well, Agent Little, you know, I've been tired, guys. I spoke to you on the chair the other day. I got brand new stuff coming, big stuff. Thanks for being a bro for sticking around, hitting that like button a lot. I love you guys. Post a vid saying he'll no longer do daily pranks. Now he's suddenly his daily pranks channel. No, the point is, I said to you, should I do daily pranks? Should I stop them? No. A lot of people say you shouldn't stop. So here we are. Finally a prank. Well, yeah, like I said, been tired, guys. Ben, keep doing pranks. Please, 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 by Jason Sarge. Guys, thank you. If you want to shout comp below right now, hashtag brofo with your comment. Apart from that, I'm Ben. Sorry, bro. Brofos, bros forever.